Run it up, Kel. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. We are in New Mexico. We are at Indoor Nationals. Hey, coach. <laughs> last meet of the season, indoor. This is my last collegiate indoor season. And we are here. We got these nice, uh, like, vest kind of things on. And our whole team is in the lobby. So I'm going to record and show everybody. But I'm so excited to be here. It's actually Wednesday. We got here last night super late. So that's why I haven't picked up the camera yet. We are about to go over to the track just to do a quick little shakeout. Nothing crazy. We have a pre-meet tomorrow, um, which is where I'll actually get over hurdles and get more active. But today we're just like flushing out the plane ride that we had from last night. So a lot of you guys always ask like, what's a shakeout? And it's really just like moving your body around, flushing the legs and just making sure that you're not tight, tense, and you're just getting that mobility that you were constricted of while you was on the plane. But yeah, the edges are edging, period. And the rest of the team is right here. Y'all, we out here. Period. Part. We done our shakeout. You know, it was real quick, real easy. We're about to take some nasty bee juice. The altitude is really, really high here. So we have to make sure that our blood is deoxified. I don't even know what I'm saying. Let's ask Devin. Why is it important to drink bee juice when you're at a higher altitude? Because it helps with the nitrates and block. Uh, See, I knew she was gonna know the answer. I knew it. Uh, 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 <laughs> and just like that. That's it. Time to go. We got my man Luke here. He's still here. As usual. Good to this again. You excited for this weekend? Yeah. You're doing your hand symbols. What's going on? <laughs> 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 yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's a video. Okay, guys. So the team decided to get some tacos. I don't know the name of this spot. It's called La Lanita. La 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 something. <laughs> oh, um, we're gonna let y'all know how it is, but it's about nine of us in here. Me, Megan, the Joe right there, Karima, the rest of the team. The Joe got a breakfast burrito, like it's not one o'clock, and it's really three back at home. That breakfast is actually solid. Y'all, my camera's about to die. All right, so the food was good. I got some burrito tacos. It was cool, and. It's two o'clock right now. I literally have a massage at two o'clock, so I'm rushing down the stairs um, because we just got back. Just threw um, my compression shorts on so that I can get my massage. I'm gonna be maybe 30 seconds late because this elevator is quick. And this is how we looking. Perfect. Killing me. He not ain't killing me for real, but he doing what he need to do. I just got the best massage ever. Larry is amazing. Um, I'm actually about to head to the mall right now just because we are like I plan a team dinner tonight. So you know, some people I get their nails done, gotta get their um, dresses, shoes, outfits, whatever the case is. I'm gonna leave my camera here to charge just so that it doesn't die. Um, and I can show you guys me getting ready later tonight. We don't compete for another two days, which is why we just decided to do something as a team. And yeah, I'm about to head out. I did something new with my hair, as y'all can see. It's like, it looks kind of funny. But like, I've been seeing so many like Instagram girlies do so many different styles with their natural hair. So I just wanted to try it. But look at the view from my hotel, y'all. We are in New Mexico, Albuquerque, New Mexico. We are in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Like, you can literally see miles away. Like, city girl like me ain't used to that. She ain't used to that. But yeah, I'm about to throw on my little sweatpants and get ready to go to the mall. So I'll see y'all once I get back because, like I said, I need to charge up my camera. So I'll catch y'all then. 
Okay guys, sorry I did not show y'all me getting ready because literally when I got in from the mall, we had to rush. Because we thought we had a freaking team meeting at 6 o'clock. I got back at 5.40 and I rushed, got in the shower, ironed my dress, started my hair, finished my hair, started my makeup. And while we get down there, they talking about some no team meeting. Like what? What? Be for real. But I'm gonna show y'all my outfit. Like I said, we're going out as a team. You know, it's a little team dinner vibe. But this is a vibe. I feel like it's giving, you know, nothing crazy. I got this dress from Amazon. Showing a little ad moment. Thank you, my good sis. My ex roommate from last week. <laughs> She's in here. This is Crystal. Her bathroom is being occupied, so she came in here and, uh, right. Does she be taking long showers? No, but she said she was gonna be done. I said it's yours. Yeah. No. Nah, and then you had to do your makeup and everything. Mm -mm. We didn't have time for it. We didn't. So, yeah, we're about to leave in about 20, 15, 20 minutes. And we're gonna be on our way. So, I'll catch you guys once we get back because we're literally just about to be at dinner, not doing anything spectacular. Um, I'm gonna see if I can take some pictures and, you know, insert them in here. Per. But I catch up when I get back. We just got back from dinner, and as you can see, my eyes are probably like a little red, and it's just because the time zone is really, really tearing your girl up. You know, we're on a two different, we're on a time zone of two hours ahead, or no, behind. Yeah, it's 9.53 right now. It's 11.53 back at home. So I'm definitely feeling the time zone, but the dinner was a success. It was about 18 of us that all came out. We were all able to sit together. And we just really need to do more stuff like that as a team. Um, so I'm glad that I was a person who initiated the team dinner for all of us, you know, to just team bond and bring everyone closer together. You know, everyone's out here living their own lives and doing their own things and just, you know, going through life. So it's nothing to just have a quick little reset and a little moment with your teammates who you're about to go to war with. But yeah, that's it for tonight, guys. I have to be up in the morning at like like 9, 10 o'clock. So I'm about to get to bed. Um, my hair came out pretty good. And yeah, I'll see y'all in the morning. Bye. Good morning, my loves. It's 9, 14 in the morning. And today is pre-me day. We compete tomorrow. So we're gonna be getting over some hurdles. We're gonna be getting a little more active like you guys seen in my last couple vlogs of what we do, you know, prior to the day before we run. So, it's 9 15, like I just said, 9 14, 9 15, whatever. I'm about to head downstairs and get breakfast because it does end in 15 minutes. So, I need to hurry up and stop talking. I just threw my hair up because I literally just got out the bed, brushed my teeth, and washed my face. So, yeah, let's go get some food because your girl is stomach is. <laughs> I'm dressed for the checkout. These are the national uh, sweatsuits that they gave us. You know, every year they provide us with national gear, indoor and outdoor, if you make it to national. So this is one of the outfits that we wore, just like the little vest that I had on yesterday was kind of the same thing. Um, I'm about to head downstairs because we're going to the track at one. It's 12.57 and these elevators be taking so long. But my mom made it. My little sister, my brother, they're here to watch me compete. So I'm super excited. Competition day starts tomorrow. And yeah, all good vibes, all good energy. Can't wait to get over to the track and get over some hurdles, cause the time is now. But yeah, I'm done wrapping y'all up. I'm about to go downstairs so we can get walking because as long as these elevators take, I'm about to, I'm about to be late. Mm. Walking over to the track. <laughs> Say hey, Crystal. Hey, y'all. Oh, we about to get hit. It's definitely a green light. No, we about to get hit. We really just crossed without looking. We stayed Yeah, we way. definitely just crossed without looking. Left the whole team behind. They still across the street. <laughs>
All right, y'all, so we just made it to the team area. Yeah, we got our little flag going, period. We about to throw our shoes on and get ready for our shakeout, our preview. This is a preview. I don't know why I keep saying shakeout. But the edge is laid, and we about to get ready. I'm so mature. I'm so mature. All right, y'all, we about to get warmed up and ready to go. So I'll see if I can get some footage. I don't see our manager who usually reports for me. I just kill my ass. Not the best idea. I'm over here listening to this, system, so that's what I'm saying. But yeah, I don't see our manager right now, but I'm gonna keep my camera on me just in case I do pull up on her. Record. Everyone was so occupied and that honestly wasn't my focus because we have a job here to complete and of course I love to bring you guys on this experience and the music is so loud in here. Love to bring y'all on this experience but like if it doesn't work out then it's like I'm not gonna force it because the goal at hand is to compete very well and of course thank you guys with me but if it doesn't work out you know it just doesn't work out so I'm sorry that I didn't get to record my shakeout but yeah we just finished we have a team meeting coming up I'm gonna take run back to the team area so that I can grab my props yeah, this is the madness that hey, 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 <laughs> a picture of a video, say hey guys, we got the uh, photographer, we got the social media queen, and we got the social media, in, what, intern, ex, wait, <laughs> what, what, what is your job title, oh, okay, so, you the social media and manager head. She does it all. She does it all. Okay, okay, okay. Good, good, good. All right, y'all, but we about to be out. You know. Look at her hair, y'all. Hold on. Let's get into the voluptuous curls. Ooh. <laughs> What's up, guys? I'm back. I'm so sorry. I look a mess. We had... We had a team meeting once we got back from the track. We got our bibs, our credentials, and our NCAA gifts. We got, this is honestly the best gift that we have probably gotten. Usually they just give us like a water bottle and a participation medal. But we actually got a North Face bag, this NCAA um, roller. This cool little roller and recovery ball. So super cool. Like we literally do not get none of that. And then we also get, like I said, a participation medal. And these are just really good for like, you know, popping up in like on a desk or something. But it just says 2023 Indoor Track and Field Championships. Real cute. And right after the team meeting, I had a massage and then I went to go see my siblings and my mom. My dad couldn't come this me. He's having some knee problems, so prayers are for him but we are actually about to go get chipotle for dinner like i said in every single vlog y'all know that i like to change up what i eat prior to race day so we're gonna keep it consistent we're gonna keep it moving the way that we do throughout the whole entire year or how we have up until this point so i'm about to i mean this is what i've had on all day um i'm about to throw my pants and go get some food because your girl is hungry real hungry for and i think my little sister I think my little sister is planning to stay with me tonight um, so that my mom and my brother can both have their own beds. And since I have an open bed, it's like, girl, why not? Why don't tell me, baby sis? Fry, fry, fry. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm going to catch y'all when I get back before I shower, wind down, and get ready for bed. All right, vlog. I just got back. It's 9 o'clock. It's time for me to shower and lay down. Meet day tomorrow. So, yeah, it's not going to be it's not gonna be nothing too much. But we know. You know. I need... I, I don't know why, I still feel like I'm on the elevator. Does it ever happen to y'all? Comment below, because why do I feel like I'm still moving? But yeah, I'm about to hop in the shower, lay down, and call it. I'll see y'all in the morning. Um, You know, we doing over here, hydrating with the Essentia. And yeah, that's it, y'all. Um, Chipotle was great. So yeah, I'll catch y'all in the morning. Love you guys. 
what's up you guys it is race day and sorry that i look like this my hair is not done and i just look super duper dry um i just ate breakfast and i'm about to get ready now just so that i'm not rushing and i have a little time to do my little tiktok dances y'all know how we do i'm not nervous right now i'm just a little jittery like because i'm just like ready to run ready to compete um because i just know that the like i said in my last video like the success i just know it's gonna be amazing so my legs hurt sitting like that but yeah i'm just super super ready um i feel great i got a good night's rest um i got a good breakfast and then i do want to order some food before i go to the track just so that you know i'm staying nutrified if that's a word <laughs> but yeah let's get ready um, I just had a talk with my mom and that was really motivating and inspiring. Today's actually her birthday, so you know I gotta put on for my good sis. Y'all know how we do. So let's get ready for meet day number one and yeah. Ah Yo, I got Panera Bread, and it's the uh, teriyaki chicken bowl with broccoli, quinoa, you know, some good eats prior to meat day. Okay, y'all, so we're ready to go. I am recording my TikToks and my dances. Release a little bit of energy, but we're about to walk over to the track now and get focused and get my mind right. These are our credentials that we have to get you know to from and around the facility because like just any and everybody can't just like walk in the team area or walk in the warm-up area so that's the credentials but yeah i'm about to head out um i got my water i got my banana and we're good to go so i'll see y'all once i get to the track before i warm up all right so i just got to the team area i'm about to throw my bib on find the check-in area so that i can sit down and chill for a second i'm gonna warm up for my first go round at 225 it's 143. my coach decided that i'm gonna warm up a little early like two and a half hours earlier before i run so that my body can believe that i've already had a round i'm about to warm up soon <laughs> Just envisioning, focused, excited, ready, and yeah, let's throw this bit number on and find the check-in area because I don't know where it is. to you guys after i ran yesterday um just because it was a great race i had a great race i felt amazing um my collegiate record did get broken um which happens you know like i tell people all the time that like records are meant to be broken just like i broke someone's record someone broke my record but i have another opportunity today to you know re-break the record and have my name in the record books for a whole nother year until somebody else competes at the collegiate level next indoor season. 
it's a part of the game it's a part of sports um i'm just ready for today i don't know how much of me you guys will see me because i have a job to handle and i don't think that i need to say anything else um this is a life-changing moment for me so i know that you guys understand of course i'm gonna post my races and post what i can um but until the job is complete um i'm gonna be very fidgety very anxious not too nervous because you know i mean nerves are good it's like it's a difference between nerves and being scared like people think that just because i've done track like my whole life that like i don't get nervous i don't like no i do uh, i'm about to do my shakeout right now i'll take you guys downstairs with me to do that but yeah i'm excited i'm ready the time is now i mean there's nothing else more to be said uh it's gonna be an amazing race an amazing outcome um, I've been praying, I've been working hard, I've been doing everything that I can do, so whatever God has for me, I want it for me. And I know the Lord will guide my steps, guide my feet. Um, I'm focused, I'm determined, I'm ready, and yeah, the time is now. I don't think I've seen her smile yet. Are the twins? When does it stop? Be I am ready to go to the track. I just got my food. Um, my hair was taking me forever, which is why I didn't record it. I was like, it, it it gave me some trouble, but I wanted to try something new, so I got like a little half up, half down with like some hair out. Um, I ended up getting Panera Bread again, same thing I got from yesterday. Um, it's the broccoli and chicken teriyaki bowl from Panera, like I said. Um, it's like 12.50, about to go downstairs because they wanted to give me two knives instead of a fork. So, I gotta go downstairs and grab, um, ew, this looks so dingy. Our warm-ups look so dingy now, but I've washed it so many times, like, and it's all wrinkled. This is not a good representation. But it is what it is. Got the edges laid, hair laid. And yeah, we about to head over to the track, y'all. I'll catch y'all when I get over there. Great start by Bullock, as well as Charisma Taylor, who's over here from the triple jump. It's going to be Akira Nugent off the last hurdle. Yes, right there with Masai Russell. The kind of race we expected to see run seven. 